Oh, you just caught me chopping up some wood. I wish you'd come here five minutes earlier. You should have seen from where I started. What a beast this is. Tell you what, whilst you are here, you know there's uh, social media, it's full of opinion. What's best, what's not. Steel versus Husqvarna. You've got Milwaukee versus, well, there's no, no competition with Milwaukee really. It's just the best. It's all about matter of opinion. And what matter of opinion most, we're gonna talk about now, is silky saws. Are they the best in the world? Well, watch this little video and find out. Cue the intro. Bold wear on that <laughs> If I said to you, Zubat, Gunboy, no, they are not types of Pokemon. If I said to you, Gunfighter, no, it's not a Western. If I said to you, Big Boy, we won't even go there. These are actually ranges and names of the best hand saw currently on the market. This is Silky. So let's start with the smallest one we have in the range. These are available on our website, hayesmachinery.co.uk, and the smallest one we keep in stock is called the Pocket Boy. Simple reason is, small enough to fit in your pocket. It is ideal. Um, perfect for camping. Uh, if you need to chop up a little bit of wood for your fires and things like that, these are a really nice lightweight saw. Comes with a rubber grip on there, solid blade, nice easy folding. So you've got difference between these saws. You've got folding saws, voila, and you have fixed blade saws. We have got so many different types here. I could do a video, five, 10 minutes on each of these saws. Don't worry, I'm not going to. This is an overview video today. So the next one, one there's another pocket boy. Once again, Different color handles represent the different type of blade we have on here, different type of tooth size, and obviously blade size on there, but they're both very, very similar. And then we have this one here, which is a Super XL 21, or Z1, sorry. This one here, nice and easy. Once again, folding saw. More features, we'll talk about that in a second. We have my personal favorite. This is the Gomboy. Yes, like I said, not a Pokemon. It's an actual pruning saw, and this is my one. So this is the one I really use. I use this for hedging. So I go up inside the hedge. I've got a large lower hedge. Chop it down, nice and easy. Much safer than taking a chainsaw up there or something, something like that. Really, really good. The little F180. Once again, that is our cheapest little one. And then we have the Big Boy. Yes, that is a real name for a saw. This one is called the Big Boy. In fact, this is the Big Boy 360. There's a few different Big Boys out there. Put a comment below if you think you're one of them. But this Big Boy is a pruning saw. This is a nice two-handled saw, really designed for larger stuff. There are bigger saws than this. This is, if you think you're a Big Boy, this is this bigger one. They do what's called a Katana Boy. Yeah, one meter large, large blade on there. Once again, two-handle operation. Why would you use one of them rather than a chainsaw? Well, it's a foldable saw, no petrol, nothing that to worry about. If you want a bit of fitness, it's ideal. They're really good saws. If you are a bit, obviously a bit more eco-friendly, or you, you don't want to have to go down and get fuel all the time and so on and so forth, then these pruning saws are really good. Next blade is the Zubat. So this is the fixed blade. Zubat, once again, not a Pokemon, it is a saw. Yeah, if most people have had a silky saw in the past, anything like that, it's generally the Zubat. It's their top selling saw. It's the one that most arborists would use if they go for a hand saw. They come in a variety of different lengths. We have two different lengths uh, in our showroom at the moment. So this is a 330 by example. They do a 330 with large teeth, fine teeth, all different sort of um, teeth on there. Uh, that's a really, really good saw. And then the Gunfighter, the Western. That's what this one is. This is the Gunfighter Curve curved blade, we'll talk about that later. These ones here, really nice rubberized grip. This is one of the newer saws in their range. Uh, it's been out probably a year or so now, but this, like I say, it's a really, really nice design. Solid grip handle. It does look very much like a gun. Um, so that's probably the reason why they do call it the gunfighter, but nice solid saw, flexible blade, really easy clean cutting. Oh, Zubat. One thing I like about Zubat, the scabbard even looks like something you put your um, your katana in or your um, or your proper samurai sword. Look at that. Bit of bling. I saw about a few of the features on these saws. So what you notice is there's a lot, lots of different blade sizes. So this one, for example, this Gunboy. This one's my one, my own personal saw. This one's got a curved blade. The main difference between a curved blade and the straight blade is as you're sawing, the silkies work slightly differently. They work on a pullback stroke. So you push through, and pull back, when you pull back, that's when it's cutting. So you're using all your energy on the back. An old standard saw, standard saw, you'd be cutting to and from, which means you're using a lot of energy going through a piece of wood. This one here, you, it's easy, much easier to pull a saw than it is to push it. So they do that by their, their large tooth here. So as you pull back, it actually removes a massive amount of material compared to a standard saw. So that's what makes these cut really, really quickly. The curved blade, 
means there's more pressure going on the saw as you pull it backwards. So without you having to put pressure on there, the angle of the blade is doing that. The straight saw, once again, because you're going straight, you pull it back at a slightly different angle. Um, it's better for a more precise cut. So if you're really, really nice, neat cutting, you want a straight blade, you want really fast, aggressive cutting, and just to limb those trees and things like that, the curved blade's the way to go. These are all class of pro user tools. Zubat, for example, nice sleeve here, a scabbard, you've got two rollers on here, nice into collecting. You've got your belt hook there, clip on the back, so if you need to take it away, really, really nice little design on that one there. Like I say, go anywhere, you'll notice that these are what's classed as the best handheld tool on the market. These have been, Silky have been producing these sorts since 1919, and they're all made in Japan. Silky saws are manufactured from SK4 carbon seal and cut out by a laser. The teeth are designed with no set, which means they're formed inside the width of the blade. This reduces the friction and enables a cleaner, faster, and easier cut. Many other saws have teeth formed to project outside the width of the blade and requiring much greater effort when sawing. Silky saws will always cut quicker and cleaner and easier than most other saws in the market. This is what makes them the top saw to buy. So all these saws here, even though the blades look very similar, there are so many differences. I can do an individual video on each of these saws. Um, there's so much to talk about. I mean, if you wanted that video, if you wanted any particular video on any of these saws, by all means, drop us a comment. Bear in mind, all these saws are available on our website, hayesmachinery.co.uk. This is the range we actually keep in stock on our, in our showroom as well. Um, like I say, for this one here, this will be our, our cheapest unit. Uh, this one is a moulded plastic handle. Uh, this is called the F180. Uh, once again, these are available in different uh, different tooth size, um, you can have fine, you can have extra fine, depends what sort of um, work you're doing. You can have large tooth size, which, which I've got on this one here, just so I can clear through the material as quick as possible. There are so many different variations that Silky do. The whole catalogue is huge. They've got pole pruning saws, really, really long, up to 7.7 .7 meters in length. And they have two handled saws, like I say, the Cantana with a three meter blade. They're really, really good for, like I say, large logging sort of things. So once again, all available on our website. Any questions at all, like I say, Silky is the best on the market. Um, no questionable. There are so many other brands on, out there, but these are rated as the toughest. So yeah, drop us a comment below if you want any further videos. Right, so now it's time for our subscriber giveaway. Remember, all you need to do to enter this competition is subscribe to our YouTube channel and also put a comment in one of our videos. Today's lucky winner is Jordan E. Congratulations, Jordan. You have won yourself a silky baseball cap, a silky beanie hat, and some silky stickers. By all means, give us a message on info at hayesmachinery.co.uk. Give us your details and things like that, and we'll get these goodies away to you. Thank you very much for watching this video today. Any more videos, by all means, put a comment below if you want to see anything else. Let us know. Uh, thank you very much. Take care.